Hi everyone, let's try to solve this exponential inequality. We have 2 power 2x minus 2 to power x plus 1 minus 2 cubed greater than 0, where we use a substitution method to solve this. So let's first change our inequality to be 2 power x squared minus 2 to power x times 2 to power 1 minus 8 greater than 0. At this point, we'll let u equal 2 power x. So we can write u squared minus 2u minus 8 greater than 0. But now we have a quadratic inequality that we need to solve. Let's first factorize it. We'll get u minus 4 times u plus 2 greater than 0. We can try a graphical method to solve this. So let y equal u minus 4 times u plus 2. We can use this equation to solve the inequality. The first thing we'll need are the x-intercepts. So let y equals 0. So we'll have 0 equals u minus 4 times u plus 2. From that, we can see that u will be 4 and negative 2. And those form the x-intercepts of our graph. So let's draw a graph. This is our x-axis, which we've let equal u. And this is our y-axis. So u equals 4. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4. And we have u equals negative 2. So negative 1, negative 2. This is 4 and this is negative 2. Notice that u squared is plus 1u squared. So this coefficient is positive, which means your graph will open upwards. So we can draw our quadratic like that. So your function, y will be greater than 0 when it's above the x-axis. y will equal 0 on the x-axis, and y is less than 0 when it's below the x-axis. So we can see from the graph, our two required areas are here and here. This is where our function is positive. So we can write u must be less than negative 2, or u must be greater than 4 to make this inequality true. Going back to our original substitution, we can say that 2x is either less than negative 2 or 2x is greater than 4. Let's consider the graph of y equals 2 to power x. We can see from the graph that our function always takes positive values. So this inequality has no real solution. So it's not possible for your function to take negative values. So this has no real solution. For the second inequality, we can write that as 2 power x greater than 2 squared. Therefore, x must be greater than 2. And we can see that when we look at our graph. So when x is 2, the value will be 4. So any value greater than 2 will give values greater than 4. So this is our only solution.